Alright guys, so today we're going to be building something a little bit different. I got some feedback on my channel, and a lot of people suggested that I should make more unique content that's not already on YouTube. And so today, we are going to be building a chicken. A very big chicken. So, these are all the materials you'll need. You'll need 124 white wool, 124 snow, 2 black wool, 30 yellow terracotta, four orange, or sorry, eight orange terracotta, four red wool, and two brown carpet. And these, this brown carpet is optional. So let's get right on into building it. All right, so we're gonna start out with the feet. So you wanna dig out 12 blocks, all in a line just like that. Then dig out this block here and this block here. Then you're gonna fill that all in with your yellow terracotta. Then come out to the back one block behind the yellow and you're gonna go up four blocks. These are gonna be the legs of the chicken. One, two, three, four. And then for the body of the chicken, you're gonna be alternating your wool and your snow. So you're gonna to wanna to come out to three blocks behind the foot, and then you're gonna go four blocks in front of the foot. So one, two, three, four. And then you're gonna take it out to one block on each side, whoops, one block to the side of each of the legs so let's bring this one out as well and then you can just fill all this in all right so now that you've got the base of it you're going to want to go around and build up the sides of it just like this making sure that you're alternating your snow and your wool blocks so go ahead and fill all that in and then when you're done that then you're going to come out by one block here, these are going to be the wings of the chicken, and make sure it goes up that far. And the wings are going to be four blocks tall, so you can go ahead and fill in all the wings, and then also fill in the rest of the sides of the chicken. Alright, so now that you finish the sides of the chicken, it should look something like this, kind of boxy right now, but we're about to fix that. So you're going to put, I was about to say the lid, but I don't think that's really the right name for this, the back, the back of the chicken, that's what we're doing now. So same kind of pattern, just alternating your snow and your, whoops, don't put that there, alternating your snow and your wool block. So almost done. Okay, so now that you're done with the lid of the chicken, you want to come on out to the front of it, and we're going to start working on the head. So, bring it out two blocks, just like this, on both sides. Whoops, and remember to alternate your snow and white wool. Fill in the bottom of it, just like that. Now you're going to get out your red wool, and put all four of them right there. That's a little red dangly thing on a chicken. I don't really know what that's called. Now get out your orange terracotta and you're going to build the beak of the chicken right there followed by yellow that looks somewhat chicken beakish now for the actual head of it you're going to get out your snow and wool again and just kind of build it up like this once you get up to here you're going to add the eyes so just one black wool there one black wool there and this is also where the brown carpet goes if you choose to use that it just makes it look a little bit better so yeah, then just continue up with your wool and snow. And this layer, I did not do that right. This layer is going to be your last one. So just fill that in. And there's your chicken. Alright, so now that you've got the structure of the chicken made comes the interesting part. We want to make this chicken so that we can live inside of it. So first thing to do is obviously to make an entrance for it. So come around to the back of your chicken, knock out these two blocks, and we're going to build a slime block launcher to get into it. So you're going to want to put up your slime blocks, immovable blocks next to these. Oops, I actually forgot my redstone dust down there. Put your redstone dust there, then immovable objects around it, and then you can put a button there and there. And then test it out and it should launch you right in. Now once you get in here you can tell that it's pretty dark so 
we're going to have to do something about that. So the way I like to do it is just replace some of these wool with glowstone. Whoops, try not to fall out the back of your chicken here. So yeah, just replace some wool with glowstone. You could do the whole thing if you wanted it to be a nice symmetrical pattern. Then once you've got that in there, come up to here. We can't just have our chicken glowing. So just cover that up with white carpet so that it looks good. Now back inside the chicken, we need to furnish this place. Okay, so the way you furnish this is really up to you. So this is just going to be my ideas on how to do it. So we're definitely going to need a farm in this. So get out some dirt, put some water here, and then till that so that it can get ready for planting. Now come over here, you can put a bed here. That shouldn't get in the way of being launched up here. Yep, perfect, you land right on your bed. Now, every good base needs quite a few furnaces, so you can put those right around your bed. Now, I don't want to fall in that water there. Let's see if we can get some lily pads to just, whoops, I didn't actually pick those up. Lily pads, and that way we can just cover up that water there. Now one of the cool things about this design is that if you actually come over here you can take out these blocks and you can't actually get up there because if you take out any more of these then it will show from the outside. But these spots right here are really great for storage. So you can put chests there, there. You can't actually put one above it because it won't be able to open. But you can fit a trap chest right there and then you can still open all three of them. Now what else does a house need? Probably a brewing station. Every good house needs a brewing station and an anvil. So let's grab one of those. Brewing stand and an anvil. You can put one over there and one over there. Now the next thing that we definitely need in here is some paintings. These walls are just looking way too bare. So let's grab a couple paintings. Maybe th Ooh, I like that one. Throw one up there, one up there. Huh. Same painting all three times. That's kind of boring, actually. Let's see if I can... Nope, it's just going to be the same. Oh, there we go. All right, and there you have it. That is your fully inhabitable chicken. I know that's what you all definitely wanted. So if you like this kind of video, then you should let me know in the comments if I should keep doing stuff like this or stick to regular redstone videos. I did have one request for pixel art, but I figured I should make it more interesting than just the traditional two-dimensional pixel art. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And one last thing before I go, I'm probably going to be doing less tutorials. Most of you seem to say that you like the Man vs. Minecraft series better than the, than the tutorials, so hopefully I will be doing more of those and less of these tutorials. Now, I just realized that I'm basically matching him. Maybe if he was better dressed in this cool suit. But anyway, that's it.